Ahoy there, YouTube! I'm back again today for another review, and today we're going to be talking about the aluminum metal container holder, whatever stupid crap they call it on Amazon. For everyone else in the know, this is a metal dugout. However, they have weird names on Amazon, but I've gone through about three of these in the past, I don't know, six, seven, eight years, and I wanted to just give them a review, an in-depth review. So I just got a new one. We're going to talk about what this is for. So first and foremost, these are specifically for marijuana or tobacco uses only. There are two separate things that you can unscrew here. First one right here, and the biggest issue that you'll have with this unit. And I want to start off, I don't want to bury the lead here. These are good. These are worth $14, which I believe is what the going rate is for them on Amazon. There's tons of different ones that you'll find. For whatever reason, there's not one seller who has like a high, super high number. I don't know why. Maybe Amazon cracks down on it. Uh, but when you screw off this part, this is where you're going to put your tobacco or marijuana. Now, this is where the biggest issue lies with these products. And I'll show you the last one I had. And you can really kind of see it, it was, yeah, right there compared to this one. What happens is uh, when you screw it in, you're screwing metal on metal. And then there's like this little black piece of like, uh, there it is. It's supposed to like hold it on. And that's not the issue. The issue is the fact that the metal just slowly gives away. Then what happens is eventually when you try and close the thing, it just won't stay closed at all. It will just, yeah, start popping open, which obviously, if, you're, if you've are got tobacco or marijuana, is a big problem. That defeats the whole purpose of it. That being said, uh, it will give you quite a while before you really are going to start having issues with it. Probably, I'd say, a year or two minimum, depending on how hard you use it or how often you use it. But that side also, as you can see, uh, has a little, like it looks here, and that's because it's partially a grinder. Let's talk about the next feature of this, which is when you screw off the other side, because we already screwed this spot, which once again, is going to hold your product, whatever that may be. And you screw off the top, you're going to have a couple little compartments right here. The first one is going to have a little spring-loaded pipe, which as you can see, whoop, it's, it's a pretty nice spring. And actually, I can test it on the old one to see if the spring still works good. Because I never really used the spring that often. I'll tell you why a little bit later. Yeah, I definitely feel like that still has it. Oh, great. Uh, so these are smaller pipes, I will say. These are very uh, small pipes. And some of them come with metal. Some of them come with this, like, uh, this plasticky stuff. I'm not a big fan of these. You're probably going to want to replace this if you get these ones. My biggest issue with these, they get super duper duper hot at the end. And actually, I just burned myself today uh, because I forgot how much I hate these pipes. And honestly, I think what most people are using, if you're not going to be using this on the go, which I think most people are going to use it on the go, then this little mini pipe is perfectly fine. And that's the name of the game with this review. Everything here is fine it's just not as good as it could be it's not great this is not a great product it's just a really good product it's serviceable um so the pipe once again it will get super duper duper stupid hot at the end it's not very long it's not ideal and i think most people if you're not leaving the house might just you know just because this one won't fit in there which is a problem but if you're if you're just using it around the house or whatever you go into the backyard i think you're going to have uh, more pleasure odd word there using this one right here uh, but the other thing is inside of here, so you got your little spring-loaded thing to hold your, your hitter. Uh, you also have a slot right here for a small lighter. Now, I don't have the lighter that does it, but these are the mini Bix. Uh, and I'll, if I remember, I'll post a link down below. These are mini Bix. It works perfectly well. Everything fits right in here. You can close it, and it works just splendid. But there's one more little trick in here, and I can't get it out of the blue one. And actually, I'll tell you about the problem. The green one will just fall right out because it's brand new and the thing is this is wow that's not supposed to come there's some metal shavings in there yeah, careful with that it's not supposed to be in there uh so this thing is used to get inside of your pipe and clean it up and it works really pretty well you know it does its job but the problem is through repeated use of this it's going to start getting dirty and dirty and dirty and if you're familiar it's not just going to get dirty it will start to get sticky and once it gets sticky it starts to become really hard to get out of there and so you'll have to yourself find yourself doing it's like grab you're like oh, i'm trying to get it out and you got big fingernails it's easy to get out but once again i go back to the the whole purpose of this review which is saying this is not great if it was great it would just pop out nice and easy every single time, which it will not. Now it does because it's brand new. But after a couple months of use, it will not. And the only way you can really clean that thing off pretty much is really scrubbing it, but that doesn't work so well. You kind of have to burn it off. You have to get a lighter and kind of burn it off. Um, so not ideal, but it works really well. And at the end of the day, I, I'm going to give this one, I think, about a 7.7. .7. 
It's very good. I'll post a link down below. It does its job. Will this be your forever dugout, the dugout that you're going to have for the rest of your life? It'll be buried secretly in your left pocket when you die or something you put in your will? No, it's not. It's going to break. You're going to get frustrated because you're going to lose some of your tobacco. Wink, wink, nod, nod. And um, that's not going to be ideal. Oh, bottom last thing. Last thing. Last little nifty trick on this. And what you're like, oh, mention this old man, is the fact that it does. It does have a grinder. How does that work? You just take these two parts right here and you do it doesn't work well once again it's not the greatest in a pinch it will work absolutely it will but when you do this you're going to want to have a nice very nice flat surface where you're going to be able to store everything you're going to, want to be able to pound it down because it gets stuck up in there especially the stickier it is i don't know if tobacco is sticky of course um and what you'll end up doing is using your little uh your little thing your little cleaner and you can get them out through there but it's not ideal but once again, it's serviceable. It's good. And that's the final review. I'm going to give this one, I think, a 7.7. .7. Is it great? No. A couple tweaks here and there, a couple modifications. Yeah, it probably could be. Uh, but as it stands, yeah, it's pretty good. If for, for 14 15 bucks, it will do its job. It does its job well. You can't really smell through it except when, the, uh, when this thing starts to wear away. And even then, you really can't start to smell through it too well. Then it just becomes a risk of the thing just falling off and every, all your product going everywhere. But that's the review for the aluminum, whatever stupid crap they call it on Amazon. If this helped you out, please consider giving uh, me a like, giving me a subscribe. And in the comments below, let me know what is your dugout of choice? How do you do it? I know a lot of people go with the classic wooden one. I've just never been a fan of this. I like, despite the fact this doesn't do everything I want it to do extremely well, I love the fact that this can grind that it does have a cleaner that it can hold my lighter that it can hold a pipe that it can hold your tobacco it can hold everything in this nice little this little tiny container thing and it just looks like a discreet little portable usb charger and i do love that i don't love the fact i'll probably be getting another one in two or three years but for 14 50 bucks i'm not going to pull my hair out but there you go as always thanks for your time youtube bye bye